Today I try the video again in English and I want to make an ancient DNA result analysis from a Khmerian. Uh, two samples, one is 914 before Christi and one is uh, 971 before Christi. Almost the same time, both um, humans are on the, in the same ethnic group like Khmerians and now, surprise, the old Khmerians were not homogene, they are very heterogene and let's start the analysis. First, we can look at the first uh, result um, of this person who lived about 1000 years before Christi. The Khmerians are an a uh, tribe of Scut, Scutian ethnic group. Uh, they live in the Pontus steppe and in Anatolia and in the Caucasus, Caucasus uh, Caucasian part region and person. So first you can see uh, very different uh, regions in the MDLP project 22. What's interesting, a big part is East Asian, you see North American and East Siberian about 22% and then also a smart part Indo-Tibetan and East South Asian. This is one person um, which found in a Khmerian an antique uh, place, the, the skeleton. And you see um, the distance are very far. Tatar, Lithuania, Tatar, Mishta, these are Turkish tribes. But you see the distance is very far. Um, I have told in the last, in my last videos, um, if the distance is under 10, it's near. Under 5 is very near. And 18 is far away. Let's look at, look at the mix. Mix is, yes. 50% Nogai and 50% Aluit or Inkeri, Karelian, North Ossetian, Aluit, Nogai, you see. F um, interesting, 40% Finnish and 60% Nogai. But also here, the distance is very far. Also it's not clear. Let's look at the um, Wahudu modern population. Um, I have made this analysis too. So you see it's a little bit closer. This is about a distance of five. It's uh, said to us that this person is nearly to a Finnish man or the person, woman from central Finland, but the next is Mod Modvin. Modvin. Modvin is a region in uh, central Russia. And then you see Swedish, Russian, Russian, Finn, Norwich. But um, Dennis, a friend from me from Italia, told me that in this G25 scale, you have to be a distance of under three. This is uh, under so under three. It's a good distance, but it's over five. It's not a good distance. But the message is: look, look at this field. It's very, also from Northeast European to West Asian, big parts, then Old Anatolian, about 12%. Uh, big part North American, and the big part is East Siberian, but very, very, very different region. A lot of different region and not homogene. It's, it's important. And let's look at the second sample. It's almost the same time. It's, almost, it's also Khmerian like um, you see in the internet site um, website one moment now we we'll look at this result d d this person okay click that's now the dodicat uh, spreadsheet this person who lived about 1000 years before christy has got not so much east asian parts you see here Siberian two points, two percent, a little bit Southeast Asian, 
also about two eight and um, the biggest part is north european atlantic mediterranean is the is a part of the old anatolian people the Druze is old iranian part caucasian is very small um, 473 and a small part south asian and here you see german distance is also far away and in the mix you see it's more Swedish and then Tajik, Patan, Purushu, these are South Asia people. And here is the distance closer. Now it's interesting to see what MDLP, uh, no, it's interesting what's the results from the other Chimerian who lived in the same time. This is here, you see, this is this result. And also North European a big part, Gedrosia about 18%, Atlantic Mediterranean is a little bit, so it's bigger than of the other side, Siberian 7.44, Caucasian a little more, a little more, 7.15, and then Southeast Asian 3.98, and East Asian 2.85, South Asian um, about 1%, and this is uh, the first distance is Magerian, German, Kuvash, distance far away. And the mix, Tajik and Finn, Swedish and Tajik. You see the, the Khmerian people. Uh, one basis is, um, I think, um, Indo-Iranian part. Yes, but the other part is different like uh, Tajik or South Asian or Central Asian. But you have to know, they live together. They, they told them we are Chimerians and like um, the modern Turks, very different in, in ethnic groups together make an ethnic group. Yeah, But it's important to see that in the same time, two results are different. Also, they are Chimerians. That's the message. message. Let's look at the MDLP year 22 results from the DG sample. Also, a bit, uh, also again a big part Northeast European, Atlantic Mediterranean is the old Anatolian part, West Asian about 12%, Samoetic is the um, also Central Russia, North American is uh, a big part, and you see this time in the Iranian a bigger part, also Arctic American and East South Asian here in this. Um, calculator the East Asian parts are bigger than in Dodekat and here is the Tatar 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 but the distance is um, far about more than 10 and and the lower side you can see the mixed Croatian Bosnian Hungarian Slovenian and Udmurt Udmurt are people from Arafinic Ugric folk it's interesting. It's Finnic and Ugurish. So you see the place in Russia where are they living? They live. Where is this? Here is Moscow. In this place, as a more central Russia, near Central Asia. So you can see it. Okay. So my friends, this was an analysis of the Chimerian people there who lived about 1000 years before Christi in North Anatolia and Caucasus and, and the Pontus Steppe. Bye bye and see you later alligator. Ciao alligator.